so last night, last night I was not feeling the live. I was in a bad mood, we'll say. Sometimes it's just too much. Everything I'm doing is too much. Like stress from dealing with students, social media, whether it be this YouTube, TikTok, whatever the case may be. I'm on too much social media and like I was not feeling that live. I could not give y'all a good live last night. I just couldn't. So I ended it. Unfortunately, I should have never even started the live whenever I felt like that. Well, lesson learned. If I don't feel like doing a live, I'm just not going to do it. Because I didn't enjoy the live. It was not fun. And it was nothing that people were doing. It was just like I'm in one of those mindsets right now. Like this morning, I came to work to test my student out i'm testing my student out today i told one guy I'd be here at 6 a.m and we were start doing a straight line back i got a load today i got a test today i mean i got a lot of stuff going on i get here and my truck is abs lights galore on it and like all uh, even more lights than that like it was little like a christmas tree and i had to take it to the shop I tried the power off trick, you know, where you power off the truck. I tried turning it off, starting a whole bunch of times. Nothing was resetting it. So I had to take it over to the shop. And the shop has the truck right now. And they're all like, well, we, we the guy that, the freight liner technician that works over here, he's going to be here at at 8 o'clock. And, and then he has a couple of trucks ahead of you. Shouldn't be that long of a fix. Well, here I am in this hoopty pad truck. So now I'm testing out a student in a truck that he hasn't been in before. Like, you know, I taught him. I taught him everything I could. It's the same. It's the same maneuver, same stuff. It shouldn't be that big of a change. But you know what? It's a different truck. Like sometimes people are all like, "Oh, it's a different color," and it just throws them off. Same truck. It's just. Hey, it's a pad truck. It's not my truck. So, you know, I just I just got too much stuff going on right now. I think I'm going to probably slow it down a little bit on the YouTube videos and slow it down a little bit till I get my mind right again and then I'll come back. But right now I'm just I just got too much stuff going on. I'm too stressed out. Too stressed out. School starting back just a whole bunch of stuff i apologize for the live last night i am sorry um i know a lot of people were all like it wasn't a bad live and it was good and it was funny and i was i was just like i can't get into it can't get into nothing like i'm in my head and i need to get out i i feel i feel that i'm a lot more edgier with like my students and stuff I feel like I'm a lot more edgier I, I feel like I'm on the like brink of snapping I just I don't know I don't even know what it is sometimes sometimes I just get in a mood for one day but I feel like I've been in a mood for about about a week or two now like not too long ago my wife even said hey um don't you think like maybe you should take a break from training for a while and like go drive and you know just get a break away and um i'm thinking that i've been i've been so debating whether or not to leave springfield and go up to pittston and start training up there in pittston just to get away from some of the negativity feelings i have right now you know i'm a paranoid person for one so like i'm really paranoid thanks for thanks to working for the state of texas as a correctional officer because you're always paranoid some of the worst stuff people can do to me is say hey I'll, i need to talk to you but i'll later on today i'm gonna be thinking about that all day like it's gonna bug me like there is like i'm like no 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 let's get it out now what's going on but you know i just maybe i need a change of scenery and and like the company picnics coming up i'm gonna have a bunch of friends in town like i know it's coming so like, I start stressing on that. Uh, like, what do I have to do to get ready for that? What are we going to do? You know, just a, a whole bunch of different stuff. Like, I just have too much happening at once. Like, I do. Like, I I don't know. Don't know. So, 
if y'all don't see as many videos from me and if y'all have noticed I've been slowing down here recently I've been slowing down a lot and it's just because I just I just haven't been myself but hey whenever I come back we'll, we'll have a good time until then you'll get videos here and there whatever I can do and hopefully hopefully I'll be feeling like doing a live if I'm from now on if I feel like I'm good to do a live and I'm prepared for it and I'm like this is gonna be fun I'm gonna have fun and do a live if I don't feel like I'm gonna have fun on it and I kind of forced myself to do that live last night I'm not doing that again because I think it didn't turn out good my opinion is I was not having fun I did the whole YouTube thing to have fun and if I'm not having fun then like like I always said I'll walk away from it because the whole thing is I want to have fun with it I want to have fun I want to educate people I want to teach people I want to give people a better life and if my mind's not right like busy Blake told me a long time ago you know busy Blake he said he said hey man I gotta work on myself before I can come out there and teach my students I have to read books about empowerment and stuff like that to get my mind right to get my head on right and that's that's how I can be better for my students well it's time for me to get my head right again and get out of it but that's kind of what's going on I just wanted to let y'all know and uh kind of be like you know what my bad on that live last night I know it wasn't good I know y'all might think it was good but it was not good like comment and subscribe and until we meet again